I don't like doing this. Why? Because <laughs> I don't like to be on film. Okay, fine, then I'll keep it over here. You never heard him get me to do what you want me to do because this is all making my eyes go freaky. Do you see that? And I think this, see, if you continue this arch, I think it goes this way and leaves you a gap there. Looks like a bouquet of balloons. But that bubble goes here, and that bubble goes here. I'm not sure what you're going to do here. This bubble goes here, this bubble goes here, this bubble goes here, there's a bubble there. The dog's head, that's his nose, and that's the rest of his head, and then this is his body, and then this is his paws, and this is his tail, and this is his other ear, and if you look you can kind of see a different shade, so it looks like his ear. There's a bubble there, you just have to do, and you probably just do the diameter. It looks like a motorcycle. There's the front of the motorcycle, and the tire, and the other tire, and that's just, and then this is like a big fat Pillsbury Doughboy holding on to, this is the head of the driver guy, and that's his windshield, and he's, But in here is an unknown hole, because when this one comes this way, and that one comes that way, and that one arches around like that, there's a void here. And when that one is underneath this one, and that's not a circle because that's there, there's a void here. And this one could maybe extend out from here and come up. That would maybe cover that hole. That one can come this way, except that's where that ends, so that has to come this more this way. You might have to bring this, to, you might have to meet this just so that you close that gap, which I think you can do. That way it comes there to there and you get a, an actual circle. The blue to the blue is nicer than the blue dark to the red. That one looks like it's dirty. Fixed. And that needs to be fixed. And that needs to be fixed. I think I've decided that it isn't the blue line underneath. It's the light blue line on top. Because this height is higher than this height, and I can get a ruler if you really wanted me to, which makes my eye think that this height is shorter and this height is taller, simply because that height is shorter and this height is taller. So I think all you need to do is to extend this line, I do with a ruler, to make this ever slightly a little bit thicker to match this guy, and then that would make me not think that that's thicker anymore. What's it make me think of? Um, first and second place ribbons. Because they're shiny like this. This looks like what somebody would wear as an article of clothing with the stripes and it's not a lot of stripes. It's that's a very vibrant article of clothing. Well, no, like you, like, like a house coat or a robe or something that has flowy material and big sleeves, like you'd see on a king or a queen, something that has majestic written into it, because it's the bright, solid colors. It has a bit of a stripe to it. It has a different down the side. I mean, the bottom. This is just freaky kitty. Why is that one ball out of line? Everything else is bum 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 He's like, Mark. But he's fine this way, he just didn't make it that way. Because he still has the same effect. You noticed that it was lower than the rest, right? The biggest problem I have here is I can't completely see the edge of the circle. I can, but my eyes kind of like what you're doing with the camera lens when it's trying to focus. It's taking it's going back and forth and back and forth and back and forth trying to figure out where that absolute transition is between that color and that color. Is that art? <laughs>